Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to fix the WS App X high CPU usage in Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to simply update Windows. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply select the Settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on Windows Update on the left pane. Now in here, on the right side, simply click on the blue Check for Updates button and then Windows will try to scan for the latest updates. Then you can install them and afterwards, after installing the updates, simply restart your PC and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another great solution is to modify the local group policy. To do this, press the Windows button and simply type gpedit.msc and then select group policy or gpedit.msc from the search results. Now, in the local group policy editor, you have to navigate firstly to the following path. Computer configuration, then double click on administrative template, afterwards expand windows component, then scroll down until you find the store section and click on it. Now, on the right side, make sure to double click on turn off the store application. In here, select the enabled box and afterwards click on apply and OK. You can now restart your PC and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to turn off the automatic updates via Microsoft Store. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type store and then select it from the search results. Now in here, what you have to do is click on your profile icon then select the application settings. And as you can see, you have an option right under app settings that says app update. So make sure to toggle this option to off. Now you can close this Microsoft Store window, restart your computer and check if the solution has solved the issue. And lastly, another great solution is to disable the Windows search service. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type services.msc and then select the services application from the search results. Now, in the next window, make sure to scroll way down until you find the Windows search service, then make sure to right click on it and select the properties option. Now, the last thing you have to do in the startup type drop down menu, select it and then click on the disabled option. Now click on apply and OK to save the changes, then restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. And that's it! Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you!